Next unplayed game, World to the West. All right, let's install, installed, let's play. So I'm playing through all the games in my PC library. And today we picked Worlds of the uh, World to the West. We picked this uh, game is a follow up to Teslagrad. I never actually played through Teslagrad. I actually have that as well, also on my list. I have opened it. According to Steam, it says I played it for five minutes. I have no recollection of doing so, um, but maybe I had opened it at one point just to see briefly what it was, but clearly didn't commit to checking it out for an hour. Uh, let's do that. Let's grab our timer here. We'll give it a go and we'll start with a new game and we'll see what this one's all about. I have no idea if this is a direct sequel. I think it says it was a standalone game, so I should be okay playing this without having played Tesla Grad, but I'm sure there are things that I'm not going to understand as it probably assumes that I have played in some way the previous game. Okay, she's turned about her dad. So it's my, my movement here. Is this controller? Ah, it's a controller game. Okay, I like it already. Hey, Lumina. Hi. Two. The Blink Course. Hmm. Okay, the Blink Course. Three. Yeah, I figured that out. The, I really wish the buttons matched. Instead of being numbers. Okay. Got it. So teleporting and hovering must be a thing. Okay, so it's a puzzler. Two. That did something. There's the teleporter. It looks like it's deactivated. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm working on the really hard puzzle to, to reactivate it. Oh no, it didn't work fix it. What did we do wrong? Hey, stop. Get off the platform. It could go anywhere. Thank goodness it didn't work from now on. Get down from there. Okay. It seems to be a loose wire. Okay, I'm getting teleported somewhere and I'm not going to be able to get back. And it's going to be about me solving puzzles so I can get back to my family and to my dad who I'm just supposed to have gone and talked to to avoid this whole mess. Well, you did it. Yep. It's definitely not Chrono Trigger of any sorts. So now I've got to figure out how to get back home, blah, blah, blah. On behalf of the Tela Tesla Mansur Expedition, we will record our findings for generations to follow. Grandpa Solomon, he came here? Okay, so you're discovering a place that your grandfather... Okay, you can't go through walls. Good to note. Telestaff. Swing your telestaff to damage enemies with one. Got it. Enemy, you're a, you're a harmless little squirrel. Oh, those are my health. Got it. And that's my money. A guru in the true wild. In the wild. Oh boy. Good boy? Not a good boy. Time for the first battle. Okay. So come in for a zap attack. Get that heart. Got him. Okay. So the combat's oh, feels a little bit interesting, to say the least. But maybe it's not so much about combat. Is it more so is the game gonna be more about combat or more about the 
puzzle solving. Feels like it wants to be a puzzle solver. Who are these two? So, wait, what? Oh, so now I'm this... What? Oops. I'm... What is he talking about? Falling up? So they can go through small holes. Okay. I need a shovel. Try to use your shovel to get out of here. Some parts of this cave floor soft than others. Quickly, we're losing valuable mining time. Okay. Shovel. Dig under stuff. Oh, so I can go back here. Oh. Give me all your money. Give me all your money. That's an interesting mechanic. So now I should have the ability to dig and do things with the shovel. Not that way, clearly. Can't dig on tile. Good to know. Takes a little bit of figuring out where the heck I'm supposed to... If I just make a giant loop? Hmm, no idea. Oh, it's just going to there. Got it. I was like, where is this going? Pan to pan camera. I knew that. Figured that one out a long time ago. I want at least a heart. Ah, I don't want to do that. Ow. 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 Not worth it. I'm dead. I need to worry about those guys. Um, pfft, whatever. Jerk. I don't have enough time to do the no-hit strats. Life's too short. Flames coming on. Greetings, traveler. You're very brave to have... Oh, you're the small boy. Never mind the grand gestures, then. Do you know how long I've been here? A really long time. A really long... Oh, that's what you said. The structures of many mysteries. That looks like me at the bottom. And then there's the second person. This is how I switch between characters, I guess. And I gotta figure out now how to actually play the game amongst all the different characters and solve puzzles and everything else. With the added element of the fact that I gotta also do some combat. What? Oh, we got an overworld too? So, we gotta do an overworld thing. I have no idea how my characters intersperse yet, who they are. I get the first person trying to get back home. The kid with the shovel who thinks he's digging on the moon. I have no idea. Maybe I should have listened more carefully. Okay. Map. Use the map so you don't get lost. With seven. Seven. Button seven. That's not button set. That's button seven. Use the map so I don't get lost. Alright, um, I suppose. 
Scarf stuns creatures. Ah, of course it does. Can she open up doors? Triangle keyhole means triangle key. Square key. Or anything else that could be... Oh, what's this? Where am I in now? I'm in this... Thing. In this temple thing. Can I swing across? I can swing across. Oh, I see. So now we're back in real time to... Our reputation one of those faces. Hello? You're here already? Yeah, I didn't take long, okay? I didn't talk to everybody. Again, yeah, no talk, thank you. I like this character. No talk. No talkie talkie. Go artifact to find a paycheck to check. <laughs> paycheck to collect. That's... Never mind. Have a nice day. Now to find that artifact. Yep. Okay, let's... Uh, square key. Done. Got... Eventually, basically, I need to find a small door and realize, Hey, kid, you can fit through this small door. Like, it's gonna be a thing. Just, just wait for it. How do I go? Oh. So, I gotta do more of my own thing. I have a square key now. Any square keyholes? None that I can find. We'll backtrack a little bit. Maybe there was another one I just didn't see. I can throw turnips. Interesting. Well, that takes care of him. Can I go back now? Is she had a moment of self-realization yet? Or are we still doing the thing where she doesn't know yet? And I have to go to other places that I can't figure out yet or talk to someone in the town who I haven't talked to yet. I don't know. Let's go back in and see if we can't convince, just progress the story already. I feel like it's gotta be the gonna be the ladder. Oh, here we go. I just hadn't gone up this hallway yet. We need that key. There's a statue. Well, drat. This slab is in the way. Maybe. Nope, not gonna work. All right, now she's had her I need you moment. Maybe I will. I mean, somebody made it a cooperation puzzle. Might need <laughs> way to break the fourth wall instantly. I mean, okay. All right, teleport, use totem poles to change character. Go to totems before you're, so we got to change character. Oh, switch to you. But he can't teleport across there. Oh, he can go through the thing. Oh, and push the stone out of the way. She always has to be able to make it back to the totem. Got it. Okay. We got what? We got mind bending technology. All right. What is this? Hypnotist's mask. Your whip now takes control of creatures. Okay. So they can grab a key for me. Okay. That wasn't too hard. Um, although, wait, ever, okay, um, wait, this, no, I, no, I want to,
No, wait. I'm confused. Why can't he teleport to the totem? Do I actually... Uh, wait. Does he now have to walk himself? Your whole party doesn't just go with you. Okay. Sure I'll need him to do something. At some point. Alright, there's a... thing we want to get to. There's a totem. Want a squirrel to grab that for me. Where's a squirrel? There's one. We got the triangle key now. But that's the circle. So we need to find where we can use the triangle key. I don't know how the kid's gonna get oh the kid uses the little that thing to go up and, and back and forth. Alright. Switch to you. You've now gotta run. This is the annoying part that they each character has to run. How are you gonna get to the next area though, buddy. Okay, well, yeah. Like this? Does that do it? Are we in the same area now? I think, I think so. Yes. Yes. Okay, great. Okay. And he's needed to go and do what now? Need Scarf Lady for that. Would've been nice if there'd been like a totem that I could've turned on because then I can come back much more easily. So I mean, the game on, on a whole, I haven't gotten all of the characters yet, but I kind of see what they're doing with it. They're making its co-op based puzzles where different characters can do different things, up to five, which will make for some very complex puzzling down the road. Um, but as the game sort of stands on its own, like this, I... A lot of walking around. And not very puzzly. Uh, well, no, it is puzzly, but it's just a lot of walking around. I feel like in most puzzle games you're presented with more quick back-to-back -back puzzles. This one definitely is one of those, I mean, adding in the element of combat as well and different enemies definitely brings it to different realms that, yeah, you can die and start over, but not that it feels like it has that much of a consequence to you. I mean, a charming game. If this is the type of game you're going for, it's sort of a mix of adventure and puzzle game. It's not really my cup of tea. I could definitely see the value of it and see how some people would like it. So if it's something of interest to you, at least now you know what the game looks like and something you can pick up for me, eh. Probably won't join back into it. It's not usually quite my cup of tea, but glad I know what it is. Glad that I played it, and I look forward to playing the next game. Thanks, everyone, for watching, and until next time, we'll see you later.